We're serving the Senators of the United States every day, so that's a pretty big honor when you think about it. They really instill that in us that like you have a privilege that not very many people get. We get to see the government and be on the Senate floor every day, which some staffers don't even have the privilege of doing. My name is Trent Kennedy. I'm from Frankfort, Kansas. Um, I'm a junior in high school right now, and I'm a United States Senate page. Page program is pretty unique because it's high school juniors, and not many high school juniors, first of all, get the chance to go live somewhere else for four months, but uh, we're serving the uh, Senators of the United States every day. Typical day would be um, get up at five in the morning and then make your way down to school around 5.30 and then class starts right at 6.15 and then we'll be done at 9.45. Some of the day-to-day -day things we do, um, we're supervised by the cloakroom, which is a little um, reception room for the Senate and the Republican side has one and the Democratic side has one. So a lot of times they need help with taking papers. We do like a, we call them amendment runs. When, when a, an amendment is presented on the floor, um, the journal clerk will give it to us and then we go copy it and run it to all different kinds of places. And we do that with roll call votes and we do the uh, morning run, which is the uh, legislative calendar, calendar of business and the executive calendar. We open the doors for um, the senators during roll call votes and so that's a, a pretty unique experience because uh, we get to open doors for people like Senator McCain and Senator Rubio. For the State of the Union, we met in the Senate chamber with all the senators and then we um, proceeded over to uh, Statuary Hall and then all the press was in Statuary Hall so that was a pretty good experience. All the bright lights, I felt pretty cool for a little while. And then um, we went into the House chamber and we got to stand along the back wall so that was pretty awesome to see President Obama and Speaker Boehner and Vice President Biden and all the Supreme Court justices. We also got to uh, introduce ourselves and we talked a little bit to uh, Vice President Biden in the lobby. Other things that we've got to do while we were here, um, we got to see Senator Kerry's um, farewell address to the Senate and we got to be on the floor for that. So that was pretty unique. He gave a really good speech. It's very brought out the patriotism in you. And then we got to have a little meet and greet and shake hands with him after that. Me and Senator Moran have a very good relationship. If we're holding doors during roll call votes, he's always right there talking to me after the vote, which is something I really appreciate because he's busy and he doesn't necessarily have to take the time to talk to me, so that's awesome. We talk about everything from why he voted a certain way to the weather back home to what his plans are for the weekend or what's on his agenda for the weekend in Kansas. When I come to Senator Moran's office, I feel like I'm at a little piece of Kansas. It's really nice because everyone kind of has the same attitude and there's pictures of Kansas plastered all over the walls, which is awesome. And you can talk about Kansas things with anyone. There's just a sense of home when you come into Senator Moran's office. Yeah, some of the little things I miss from Kansas are hearing about basketball all the time, KU and K-State basketball and then my mom's cooking, all of it in general I miss. It was really hard to leave basketball, but uh, I have my senior year basketball left, so that kind of helps the decision. And my teammates and coaches were really supportive, and like the whole community was supportive. The thing I miss most about Frankfurt, not just Frankfurt, but Kansas in general, is like when you're walking down the street, everyone will say hi, and every, it's just people are very polite and just friendly. And in Frankfurt, there's only like 800 people there, so when you go somewhere, you know somebody and you can have a conversation with them. And I also miss like back roads in the country and not hearing sirens all the time. And I just miss Frankfurt in general, everything about Frankfurt. Coming over Reeds Hill into Frankfurt, I will, I'm very excited for when I get to do that the next time. The next time I'll drive will be spring break. So you might stay off the road if you're in Kansas. <laughs>